we are live. Hi. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hi. Uh, or more specifically, hello. And I just want to say yippee. Yippee. <laughs> Oh fuck! I need a. Oh, I need. That's right, Lethal Company. I forgot. I need to buy Lethal Company. Uh, Why would you need to buy Lethal Company? Don't buy Lethal Company. It's a waste of money. What? No, it's not, bro. It's don't know. If you got friends, it's, it's a. Yeah, if you have friends to play it with, yeah. But like, you got, oh, if you're buying it for okay. yourself, waste. You got friends, bro. Yeah, right? Yeah, I was invited to like fill out someone's group. Yeah, man. Oh. No, yeah, yeah, no, no, yeah, no, yeah. Look at you. Look at you, hate, bro. Let oh, I'm hating on it because, like, anytime I hop on any game ever, they're like, hey, do you want to stop playing FPS games and come play Lethal Company with me and 30 other people? And I'm like, no. Bro, it's fun, man. Try it out. Yes, but I hate massive groups more than anything. Uh, you can not, well, you can, it's maximum of four unless you get mods, which then increases it. Yes, but they have like 20 people on a DC. Bro, just play with five folks. Damn. That like Unless some I... people in VC be like, you should play Lethal Company. You're so weird for not playing Lethal Company. Damn, okay. <laughs> they were conditioned, Look, they, were, they were pressuring you. At least try it once. That's what I say, man. It, it's try it seems mm. really fun. It seems really fun. Anyways, um I'm gonna have to do the uh does anyone wanna do the recap or <laughs> Well no one does it, so I'm gonna have to do it. Last time. Uh. Oh. <laughs> are you? Are you? Nick. Are you <laughs> <laughs> All right, Nick. It's time you do the recap. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we're waiting. Uh, wait, wait a minute. Okay, so last time, last time I was in the small ship, I was miniaturized. Um, we fought a big ass kraken. Mm -hmm. I remember. And somebody, wait, wait, wait! I think somebody made a chocolate kraken or a chocolate monster. That's... It had, and had. <laughs> it was, oh yeah, it was Pharaoh. That's... He made the, he made, he made this fucking. No, no, thing. Rudy, no, wait, Rudy wait, made wait. a chocolate thing. Wait. Oh, he made a chocolate creature have sex with this kraken right in front of us. It was no, disgusting. no, no, yes. no, my, no, no, right, no, 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 the kraken. Uh, hide it with the, the chocolate. chocolate. The kraken realized it was chocolate. And then instead, my familiar has Wait, like what? sex with the kraken. Yeah. That's not any my, better. My, my familiar. <laughs> That's not any better. Is, who was on top? Hey yo. That's the true question so, there. Who was on top? So, so, yeah, so what physically it cannot be. So after they had sex with the kraken, apparently, I finally beat the entire thing. After we defeated another, we, yeah, we defeated a boat, and then after that. I became a regular person again, and then we broke out of the, I believe, the dungeon? Uh, sort of. The story that this uh, dungeon utilized ended. The pool in the very center of the room drained, really, um, revealing a latch that has yet to be opened. Oh, okay. And then okay. we open the latch and we find the one piece. <gasps> yeah. No. And finally... I will become king of the pirates. Oh, yes. <laughs> Bro, you was no pirate. <laughs> he's a thief. You're right. Yeah, he's a thief. I'm a thief. Yeah. Listen, thieves are pirates, but with class. That's a damn That's a lie. bona fide fact. That's a lie. They don't got class, bro. They just thieving, Listen. thieving black, <laughs> stealing stuff. The thieving black man. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh my okay. no character isn't black, bro. There's Just no because I'm black doesn't mean my character's black. Yeah. There's there's no honor among thieves. That's the saying. Listen. Listen. LA, okay, so. Mechanics want your car to break down. Doctors want you to get sick. Thieves are the only people that want to see you get good shit. Exactly. Whatever you say. But there's no such thing as a One Piece, right? It's not real. Listen, the one, piece the one Piece is real. The One Piece is real. Can we get much higher? It's that's such a fucking old meme. I hate myself. Anyways, yeah. The pool has been drained. Yum. Yay! Delicious. 
us. The Kool-Aid is gone. Why couldn't we drink it? <laughs> what? Why couldn't we drink it? There Why couldn't we just collectively so, drink it? There are actually some small puddles left. If you want to try slurping that shit up. That's nasty. No, do that. that don't do that. I'm going for it. Okay, right. you're just... You, I guess you would <laughs> you pucker your lips and just sort of... <laughs> off the ground. It is salty as a fuck. I mean, it is like... It is if it is as if you put... Instead of chewing tobacco, shoved salt in your mouth and just started chewing on it. I don't do that right now, actually. Ain't that cement, bro? He's drinking, like, water from cement. Huh? Actually... Why would this be from cement? Yeah, this is seawater, Nick. Yeah, that's oh. that's why I was qu that's why I was what? I didn't think it was seawater, bro. You said a small pool. Yes, a small. Yeah, pool there's like pool leftover pool. pools from it draining. I don't know why anybody would drink out of that. That's just nasty. Curiosity. Yeah. <laughs> that's uh, disgusting, bro. Uh, you don't know what type of um. Uh uh. All right. So what are we doing next, though? That really depends. There's still the metal I, latch in the middle. Can I break it? I am immediately opening the latch. All right. I break the. Uh, who wants to try to open it? I'll, I'll open it. Okay. I guess you both. I'll break. Can... Um. Look roll at... for me. Okay. <laughs> yes, clearly roll to open a fucking latch. Yes. It is. I will say this. It is entirely made of metal. Uh, more specifically, it's made out of a very odd metal. It has a slight bluish hue to it. Um, and there does not seem to be any rust or any erosion by the water. Which cannot be said about the pool surrounding it. Is it locked? Turning the giant wheel of, uh, on the very top of the latch, you open it as a sharp gust of wind blows past you. Was that a fart? Ooh. Well, it's certainly a, a salty smelling one, as the Ugh. very pungent smell of salt water hits your nostrils. Tell me, can you guys roll a perception check for me? Um, more specifically... I will not be rolling a perception check. More specifically... Noah, and I will roll one for you, Nick. Thank you. Alright, I've rolled an eight. <laughs> um, <laughs> rigged. Yeah, sorry about that, man. <laughs> Just how it is. So what's going to happen then? If I if I roll a low perception check, I just can't see none. It's more of like you don't notice anything out of the ordinary. Can I just jump in? Out then? of the ordinary? What do you mean? <laughs> We've been here before. Or okay, okay, buddy, okay. Yes, you can jump in. Going mm. up, or more specifically, you can go down the ladder. As uh, there is a very, very old ladder made of uh what looks to be very worn wood it's worn away over time through erosion of the water most likely the water that was in the pool i'm gonna just jump in i'm not even gonna touch the ladder okay hi hi oh dear about time you showed hello up. sam sorry i had to finish doing something that i'm joking i'm joking it's pleasure uh, it's pleasure you being here um, I didn't want to do it either. We missed you, Altair Sama. Yes. <laughs> Away! Alright. So, the Ooh, God, God. has been opened. And. Mm, hopping down inside. It's all the big booty Latinos we could ever want. <laughs> ah, yes. Mm -hmm. You hear the clapping down a table hallway. <laughs> <laughs> No, you do, but you do find yourself in a a tunnel. Go boat. Yeah. Oh no. Lanterns hanging from the ceiling, 
none of them are lit, so it's quite hard for you to see. Oh my gosh, the secret tunnel from Avatar. Wow. Secret? Uh, do the rest of you follow? Yes. Uh, and I volunteer to let Nick go first. I already went first. Yeah, Nick already <laughs> dove through, dove in. No, yeah, 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 no, I'm just gonna, like, stay behind him. Just in case anything happens. You're gonna use him as he a been... shield? Basically. Nah, he being a wuss, bro. I'm gonna walk through. Do I have, like, any- in, do I have light? Any type of light to see anything? Uh, currently, no. But you could take one of those lanterns and try to light it. Ooh. Or, but that. Better yet. Produce spark. Why does it produce spark? Too much fucking deep Pokemon, bro. Uh, produce flame. Does he? Yes. You conjure a small bit of fire just so in your hand as the tunnel brightens up, and this is not the right music. Uh, as the tunnel, I cannot hear your music. I know you can't. Stream can. It's playing the wrong song. Rut row. That's on me. But that's fine. All right. The tunnel, once again, lights up, as you're able to see that these lanterns are made of solid gold. Neat. Seems definitely 100% cursed. I am not touching that. What? No. Why would it be cursed? Why, why nah. Be cursed? Yeah, totally not. Totally not. You should touch it. You, you should touch it. I'm not a, I don't think I'll yeah, touch it. Don't, don't touch it. <laughs> hmm. um, now, could all of you roll a perception check? Let me just. Uh, eight. Six, <laughs> I want to. Well, I got a plus two. And what's the modifier for that? Not 20. Not well, Okay. Damn. Okay. Well, shit. I guess I'm using those dice today. Yeah. Okay. Wow, that's lovely. When walking, Rigged. When walking... Wait at dice. You guys, you guys don't know me in person. Wait at dice, clearly. You guys don't know me in person. Sean does. Yeah. He knows I wouldn't fucking lie because I think it's really interesting when we fail. Yeah. Plus, I, I think you're just weird, Sam. Yeah. I'm gonna Rick, be honest. I rolled an 8. He rolled a 20. Not fear. <laughs> All right. when... This is clearly favoritism. Yes, I am a favorite of the gods. Thank you for um, identifying that. I... Yeah, noticing. All right. when... when you guys are walking in the tunnel, Altair, there's something odd about the footsteps. There's one, two, three, four. There's, there's about five of you. But you hear six. Is there an extra set of footsteps? You hear six footsteps. If I look around, do I see an extra person? No. Okay, um... Is there a way for me to, like, sense to see if there's an arcane presence? Or, like, a presence that's- presence that is there that is not actually- that I can't see? I don't believe you have any abilities or spells that can do that. But that is true. you could try to make an investigation check to look at- I would like- things. I would like to do that. Please roll. 10 plus investigation, yes. uh, plus 2. Mm. So a 12. You cannot see anything that would indicate another person. So, um, I hear an- obvious to you. I I'm gonna point this out, party. Uh, so, I hear an extra set of footsteps, but- I don't 
like th like there's no one else around here um at least none that i can see um what do you guys make of it yeah probably shouldn't okay. worry about it it'll be fine <laughs> Yes, it shall be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Don't worry about it. Don't worry. When continuing your journey, you don't hear the extra foot footsteps anymore. Not at all. But what you do hear in this place is flowing water. That's something we'd be concerned about. Yeah. Alright, put all your characters down here. Mm -hmm. I'm working on art for my character, by the way. Thank like, you. That's, for this. That's, oh. that's fantastic. Uh, my thing's just loading. Oh, again. Don't worry. don't worry, take your time. Sad to see. Entering this new part of the cavern. Excuse me, Jesus, fuck! Ah. You see what looks to be an old pirate's hideout. Neat. Yes. But you notice something very odd. There are random rocks pebbles, and even tree branches that are made out of gold. All leading somewhere. Also, pret um, also pretend that there's oh, a bridge here. Pretend there's a bridge here. Here, here. I, I got you, I got you. Um. <laughs> yeah. Why that color? Because it's what I was defaulted on. Change it. It's what the I was told on. Blood so I had to, I had to make the joke before you made the joke. Okay. The period blood bridge. Okay. Okay. <sighs> yeah. I'm gonna like get rid of it. Right. Do you do you follow the trail? I mean, there's no I, other okay, way to not? go. I do. Yeah. Th there's no other way to go. So yeah. Following the trail, you move across the bridge, noticing many different pieces of jewelry, art even, all made of solid gold, until you come around to right over here, and you see a pedestal with a enormous solid gold hook wrapped in cloth that has been eroded I, over time. But, I grabbed. right next to the pedestal is a corpse. Can I grab it? With a diary I don't... in its abdomen. I... I'm going to check out the corpse. And... Just watch it. They grab. I grab the hook. All right. Don't don't. Don't grab it. Whenever when you reach for the hook, you feel. Oh, well, are you wearing gauntlets? Nah, I haven't found those yet. Well, no. Well, your character technically is. It's just they're not adding anything to your bonus. Oh. Okay. It's a matter of like. Yeah. Um, aesthetic. so Nick, yeah. uh, a quick question. I feel like I'm gonna get turned to gold, huh? Yeah, like if you know there's a corpse directly next to it, why do you immediately grab it? Well, it depends. Is the corpse made out of gold? Yeah, is it? Many parts of its body are, but oh, <laughs> what looks to be very odd is that there doesn't seem to be any damage to the skeleton itself. Yeah, so like, why would you grab it? <laughs> That very clearly does not look safe. Call it a human experiment. On yourself? You're like trying to speed run getting yourself killed. No, no, no. 
I'm gonna get yeah, golden. Death I'm trying to hold himself guy. on flight like that. I'm you gonna know. get. Is, is gold harder than my gauntlets? So gold is a very soft and. Gold is a very soft metal. Yeah, it's a very, Never very mind. Soft metal. Can I can I touch it with a stick? When you touch it with a stick, it slowly transforms into gold until it reaches your hand, which then it stops. Mm. Can you roll a wisdom save right. for me? Oh no. Is Nick Spartan to realize it's gonna turn him into gold if he touches it? Not an intelligence check. <laughs> wisdom. I mean, wisdom is a different type of intelligence in the in the meaning of how it is used in the game. That's true. I mean, I got negative. Yeah, wisdom is like common it, sense. A, oh, you have a yeah, negative one. Yeah, it's a difference one? between. Oh. I got negative one intel. I mean, wisdom. So All right. it's different yeah. between street smarts and I'm, I'm okay. smarts right now. So I need you to roll for me. All right. <gasps> I'll give you bardic inspiration. You don't have bardic inspiration. What? <laughs> 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 oh no. I'm gonna Nick, die. you got a three, oh, man. Oh. <laughs> no. I got a three! <laughs> no. guys, oh. guys, I thought a three was good, right? No. Right? no. You rolled a 20! Nah, no. You know, I was making a joke because it's a low wisdom score. Oh my it's god. A... I it a two. Are... Can I roll the stick? Do you... Do you don't feel anything immediately happen to you, but. You are... His bones are going, turning gold on the inside. You are oh, man. mesmerized by the glint of the gold. Bruh. <laughs> Bro, I'm getting it. Like you want to touch it. Somebody pull me away, please. Noah. Yeah, uh, no, I, I, I you don't think your character would say yeah, no, I don't. You notice more closer to it, hypnotized by the glint of the hook. Damn it! I'm going. I'm going to pull away Nick at last second, purely to make him suffer for his consequences of run again. Yeah. It's called being curious. <laughs> Ain't no wrong with being curious. Don't and don't you know? Curiosity killed the cat. Man. But satisfaction brought it back. Touch it. Oh, oh damn. That's actually a cool <laughs> saying, by the way. Um. Uh, the uh, I'll use conveniently fucking forgetting, snake. John. Yeah. Um, I'll, I'll use fucking snake hook and drag him back. You do so, and immediately when you're when you're pulled back, you snap to reality, realizing you snap back to reality. That your body was I moving without your I, own control. Can I wake up in like a cold sweat? Boom. Yeah. All right. All right. So I wake up. So what? What do I do next? Fucking nothing. Yeah. Can know, I... So the corpse itself, looking at it, there doesn't seem to be any injuries to the body whatsoever. Only its clothes and its gloves, very nice gloves by the way, are solid gold. I would. The solid gold, the solid gold gloves seem impractical. It's very thin though. Very thin material. Okay, well, can I take it for later to pocket to sell? Yes. Yes, you can. But you notice something odd about one of the gloves. There's a marking on it still visible. With the initial M. A very curvy... M? Yeah, M. M. Alright, continue. A very curvy and elegant M. Midas? The same M that's on the book in its abdomen. And the same And I read the book. And the same M. Oh no, it's Murphy. Seeing around Miss Alay's neck. Ah. Alay's still here, right? Yes. I guess Miss, she Miss was here. is still here, but she has not noticed the markings. Can I point it out? Uh, read out the book. 
No, 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 I'd like to point out the M's and then read the book. Oh. That's... That's odd. Odd. I don't know what else to call it. Odd is all you have to say. I don't know what else to call this. <laughs> well, where did your necklace come from? It, it was a gift. I... Hmm. It was a gift. What is your father. necklace made of? It's... Made out of rose gold. Hmm. Okay, I, I see the point you're trying to make. begins to grasp onto it and, f and fiddle with it, with a very confused and curious look on her face. Opening the book, most of its words are empty, or most, not words, pages. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, the words are empty. Most of the pages are empty, but it does read. If you are reading this, I am dead. I also assume that you've come to claim the hook for yourself. I may not know the reason of why you possess this hook. Or wish to possess this hook. But I tell you, to abandon your journey here and now. For my name is Thomas Henry Midas. I'm the Grand Summoner of Captain James Midas, the original wielder of this hook. And I implore you to hear my tale and to abandon everything and leave. I have nearly died. Six times? No. You know, it may not be a bad idea to just go. <laughs> Mm, no. Can I try uh, using the snake hook from earlier and see how it uh, works? Like, I just throw it over and see if it starts changing. It. When your snake hook touches it, you feel a shiver down your spine as you feel a heartbeat pull, pump from the hook. It's a lie. Oh. Do you continue reading? That's... Yes. I'm gonna touch the hook again. When I was Nick, a... I'm not saving you this time, no. When I was a... I... When I was a child, my father told me of a story of how he betrayed his own father and stole the hook. He built a life and built a town, a town of Stormstone. But he told me of its curse. I was not wise enough to heed his warnings. To break it down shortly, the curse is the very gift that the hook gives. Its power will spread even onto you. Anything you touch will turn to gold. From food to loved ones, everything. You'll be surrounded in riches that will buy you nothing. As I wait here... ...to have death take me... ...please, I beg of you... ...leave it here. I can't wait to sell this on eBay for 50 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> wait, what happened to you? And to my, you and to my granddaughter... Alay S. Midas. I hope you may never read this. Please. Leave. Well, Alay will never get to read this. Too bad she's still gonna find out. I immediately tell her to and give her try to give her trauma by saying, Hey, your dead dad's on the front on the ground. What happens if you touch the hook with gold? That's a great question. I'd like to immediately give LA PTSD. Please. LA is Midas. I 
when I was a kid, I didn't... I don't really remember much about my childhood, but I do remember that I grew up... I grew up in a, on a boat. I didn't know my last name. I actually know my last name! My yes. Wait. But that also means the skeleton's your granddad. Great yes. Granddad. Yeah. Also, wait. Hold on. Something's not adding up. If... Thomas... Used to be the Lord, or... Or his... Thomas's father used the hook to create Stormstone, then that means he's the rightful owner. Or his family is. Then how hey, LA, you should touch the hook. I'm not falling for that one. <sighs> you never know, you might not get turned to gold. I'm not willing to test that theory. Actually, wait, did Sparrow find a, a glove made of gold earlier? Yes, he has two pair. He has a pair of gloves that are made of solid gold. Bro, just put it on and touch the dang hook. How did Fabio... Yeah, okay, so... No, because... Don't you remember two seconds ago when you got stuck and you couldn't do anything? Oh. I have an idea. Alright. Is there a box around here? Yes. Yeah. Uh, there are some old wooden crates. Alright. Wait, I'm you said the hook is alive, right? Yes. Can I talk to the hook? Uh, you can certainly try. <laughs> well, right. Actually... Okay, this is a really dumb question, but will the hook respond if I ask it a question? You can only try and see. Actually, better. you know how you said, uh, the heartbeat? Yes. I'm going to attempt to feel the heartbeat of the hook again while asking it what, uh, what happened here. So only level two. Alright. You... Once again, you send out one of your chains to wrap around the hook. It's once again that familiar shiver down your spine as you begin to hear it. Ba bum. Ba bum. Ba bum. What do you say? I ask the hook, does it know where it is? It does not give out any words, but you can somehow know what it's thinking. The cave hunger. Hunger, what? <laughs> oh no, this dude's talking about hunger. Okay, that's not, that's, that's fun. <laughs> that's mildly concerning. Yes. Evil All right. I will say this. Someone could try to roll Rudy, can you do me a favor? To try to figure out what this is. Yeah. What do you need? Rudy, do me a favor. Can you make like a can? Can you make a candy cane for the hook? A candy cane for the hook. It says it's hungry. I mean, well, what could a hook eat? I I don't know. I didn't. I, I didn't naturally assume it's... that. You meant that the hook would eat the candy cane. I heard a hunger. Maybe it wants a... Maybe it would like Okay, well, I felt hungry. Maybe it's like that one guy who, like... Is... He constantly has to... He constantly has his food out of reach. Maybe it wants gold or... Yeah, maybe it's... Oh, that's interesting. We need to reload. <laughs> okay, I, I'm trying to put the it gold. in the May I try to do the same thing to feel what the hook wants? It, um, it, you can't feel anything out of it other than just... How 
how do I describe this? You feel you only the only thing you feel from this is unease. Like touching something incredibly slimy. Like a very uncomfortable feeling. But that's all you get out of it. Alright, I don't care about what you guys are doing. I'm going to put it in a box. You try to put I need like a stick. You try to I'm gonna get the stick oh, first. You're gonna grab a stick first, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna put it at the base of the pedestal and just kind of like push the hook in there. All right. Just knock it in there with the box. <laughs> Was it going to turn the gold? Do you, gold? Last, do you have any last questions for uh, the hook before I put it in box? No. Okay. Okay, I'm going to put it in box. As you... As you begin, as you touch it and try mm -hmm. to put it in the box, you hear a loud thud from down... Oh, the entrance where you came. Mm, fun. We oh. love this. More skeletons. <laughs> oh no. It's Sean, completely it's trying to make it. It's coming just, like, in. It's my turn. Gonna... Please don't make this last like three years like last time. Big old fat ugly golden mites comes in. Yep. And grabs yeah, my, uh, you do by the... hear the very familiar cackling. Sean, my Baldur's Gate's coming in. I'm gonna hide. <laughs> All right, you wanna hide? You wanna hide? I'm um, gonna hide somewhere. Roll for stuff. Where? Oh, hold on. I need to find. Some... I need to find. He needs to go away. Hey, man, cut him slack. All right. Okay. Uh, that is a six plus stealth. Uh, one. A seven. Got it. You hear the scraping of metal against the wall as sparks begin to fly off, only beginning to show off the very figure that is Midas as his ghostly green eyes pierce through the darkness. Hey, if it's if he's gold, he wouldn't produce sparks. The blade, the blade, the blade, his blade, his blade arm <laughs> okay. is not made of gold. Okay. Shut up, it was more dramatic effect. <laughs> also true. <laughs> well, yeah, but also, as we've said, gold is a soft metal. It also has a low melting point, fun fact, and I do a lot of fire damage. Okay, buddy. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, buddy. Also, gold is very unreactive, so it won't be able to produce sparks in the first place. Yeah. I, That's what I was saying. I know his blade is not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh gods. Nail him his... for being a pain. Alright. Why thank you, lads. I really appreciate this. Ah, 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 ah. I have several questions, actually. Mr. Krabs, is that you? Do I look like a fucking crab? A little bit. Yes, you do. Can you wait to murder Nick for at least five minutes? Don't so murder my questions answered. Called you murdering me, man. I didn't touch the hook. Go you ahead. called him a crab. Ask away your dumb questions. Okay. So, why did your was it him that died to some? Uh, Can I... well, sort of. Um, One of them. Basically, Captain Midas' son betrayed him, stole the hook. Uh, Captain Midas' son's son, Henry, uh, sorry, Thomas, um, is there dead. Okay, first question would be, why does Midas want the hook? I got my own reasons, lad. Okay, and if you tell me your reasons, I might be inclined to just let you have it. Imagine only being half yourself. Imagine never feeling whole again. 
having the one thing that keeps you to this mortal realm just barely outside your grasp. Oh, you just want to die? No, of course not. You really think I'm a sappy old fuck like that? No. I want to be back to my prime. In strength. Not relying. Not. Ah, why the hell shall I tell you? As he shoves uh, on the side. You were... It was pretty convincing, I'm just saying, like... Yeah, as he tries to will... reach for the hook, but... You see something from his shadow. It stretches and extends. As the room gets colder, you begin to see your own breath. As this... Green... Begins to slowly seep from Midas's shadow. He's completely unaware of this. As he walks forward, closer and closer, I... you see his body begin to slowly stiffen up. As these, gre as the green fog transforms into green spectral chains that wrap around him. <laughs> What is this? What is this? Is this your doing, Spiro? I have nothing to do with this. As it wraps Wait, how does he know your name? Uh, he, I, he's known my name for a while. I don't know how. Yes. So, this has never. This question has never came up before, actually. How's that feet on my name? Don't, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. As behind you. Jesse, you feel a presence. Oh. As a shadowy figure wrapped in a hood hovers above you. Ah. I appreciate you getting past it, this. You all have served us very well. The same with you, Mike. You've been a very good toy. Uh, while they say that, I'm going to cast, um, Blinding Dwarf. Whoa there, buddy, whoa there, buddy, so you're all. I can flack him with a stake. You, you I got a Let's see where this goes. Hostile. Hostile. You wanna cast a spell? Go right ahead. No, 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 no. let's see where this goes. <laughs> let's see where this goes. Okay, fine. <laughs> I'll, I'll see where this goes. If they start trying to, uh, if they're, when they, like, are about to leave or some shit, I'm gonna... All right. Wait. Sure. They... Where did you come from? I mean, to be fair, you you never made a check to see if they saw me yet. So, you roll as far as I know, I'm hidden. You, you as far are... as I know, I'm hidden. To Midas, you're invisible. Uh, to this dude, he just you don't even see his eyes, so you can't tell if he noticed you or not. Okay. Yeah. That's neat. Oh. As far as I know, I'm hidden. Where did I come from? I yes. came from behind you. Now, if you wouldn't what mind, the... I have to acclaim my prize. I appreciate no. all of you being fit. No. I black him with the stick. Before you move, before, Wait. It, but before the, the stick hits him, it freezes. Shattering on impact. Oh. Oh. I remember seeing hey. you also use ice. Now. Ice, man. From one ice witch to another. better. Freeze. As your legs begin to feel numb. As ice begins to accumulate around your legs. Okay, I'm casting, uh, I'm gonna cast Seeking Sun. Uh, right... Uh, okay, so this is where you're at. I'm going to create the um, area so it like it just encapsulates. 
him. I think that's the right radius. Alright. It's a five. But. I'm sorry, but like, yeah, so it, everyone's immediately fighting each other. I just want to know more. Well, no, so the reason why I'm doing this is because he's being frozen right now and this does a bit of fire damage. So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to... Is unfreeze him, yeah. Yeah, unfreeze him, but... Honestly, I would leave him there for a bit. Oh. Need to, need to think about what you've done. I'm trying to move my sphere. This figure almost angelically walks on the air. That makes sense. Choose yes or no. <laughs> oh, he does not seem to be wearing any shoes. He's barefoot. He's got the grippers out. <laughs> yeah, beware, he has the grippers. Ooh. Ah. It makes sense. Okay. One of the Fulman his family will be such a formidable foe, but I'm afraid, as the room begins to feel even colder now. By the way, I do deal damage to them. Or do you? Are there, like, like gold this objects is... around it? There are some. Very few. This does fire damage. Yes. What's the, what's the biggest thing? The reason I ca cast it. Yes. Y'all are doing too much. The spell... You said what? As he merely waves his hand as the room freezes even colder now. As your spell, your very sun, shrivels up and slowly dies. Oh, uh, hell. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so question for the new person that just walked in. Why is he here and why does he care? Oh. You don't have to worry about a thing, Sparrow. No, I do have to worry about this. At least, no, wait, what? You shouldn't have to worry for now. Oh, and Altair, be a good little princess and hold on to that ring as he grabs the hook and stuffs it in a bag in his cloak. And he doesn't turn golden at all? He does not. But that man's Wait. a ghost. Sparrow, why does everybody know your name? That's an amazing question I would love to Wait, know. Hold up. Do I recognize this person? No. Like, you it, do my, not. my, you my do spell. Not. You do not. My spell emits light. Uh, okay, then how do they know my name? Don't worry about that. You'll fi That's something for you guys to figure out. <laughs> Wait, do you know my name? Wait. Honestly, you're inconsequential to me. Damn. Hey, hey, hey I'm <laughs> I, You're still in punching, guys. You know that, right? <laughs> what is bronze in comparison to raw magical power? Can I just try to deck him? Okay, whoa, whoa, hold on. I need more answers. What is with the chains? Oh, that, that is something that I know. I need you to show me it immediately. Just wait and see. You will meet him soon enough. And as for you, Midas, I think we'll be taking those <laughs> gifts back. As you see Midas freak the fuck out. As he violently shakes, as these green, these glowing green cracks begin to appear upon his body, as parts of his skeleton return to being a skeleton once again. Oh! Parts of his skeleton turns into a skeleton again. Okay. His Wait, Sean, body... what's the biggest? Look, words are hard sometimes. The biggest object that you could probably reach is uh, a fairly si a fairly large rock. <laughs> you are nothing to do, bruh. <laughs> gonna eat it? I'm gonna throw it out. I'm gonna see what happens. Alright. You fucking yeet the rock. And as soon as you do it, a crisp, a beautiful, almost ornate 
Ice barrier forms out of nowhere to block it. What the hell? As I said Not again, a... what is Not bronze old. when comparison to the beauty that is magic? Bro, I hate this guy. Wait, hold up. Magic? No, he no, hold on. He, no, no, he might be cooking. No, fuck that dude. He, he, he blocked it. Got... I got an idea. I'm gonna be real. Midas has been the biggest pain in my ass this entire time. Yes. And you're telling me some dude comes over here, deals with the problem for me, and then it takes some treasure that I probably can't do anything with. No. Really, that would probably uh, harm you as well. Yeah, that too. Away, Sparrow. I cannot wait for you to uncover the mysteries of this beautiful kingdom just like your father did. Bro, what? I got Who's your dad? No, no, big dad. He turns into snow and then disappears as the spectral chains that once wrapped around Midas are gone. Bro, what a hoe. Yo, Sparrow, no. who's your dad? I'm, no. I wish I knew. He says, you promise me. <laughs> it's time for battle. You did kind of put this on yourself, you know. <laughs> it's time for battle. Uh, you guys are going first. Which, All right. by the uh, way... Oh, hold on, I have to grab... I'm scared to... There we go. A lot of guys. Yes, that is. All right. And I use... So whose turn is it? Whose turn is gonna be first? Well, I have to think about it. Uh, I've got. You see, I have an amazing idea now. <laughs> What's that idea? I can summon the rabbits. What's the idea, John? I mean, they're all kind of like close together. I can pull them up. So oh, you know when you like? Uh, no, not that. A better idea than the hollow verbal. All right. Uh. It requires cooperation from Rudy. Oh yeah? What's your idea, man? Remember how you said, said blowing them up a second ago? Yeah. What if... I just put Midas into... Like, lock Midas in with, uh... The wall, and then you blow them up while they're inside. Also, I'm finna be AFK Sean. I just swarm them with peeps. Alright. I'm into this plan. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we can... <laughs> okay. We could just microwave them with some peeps and just have them drown in marshmallow. I got some fire damage stuff I, I don't can think do. you can. I don't think you can drown a skeleton. Uh, you cannot. Uh, As a matter of fact, I have one fire the, thing I can do. By the way, when all of you guys have taken your actions, uh, pre please press, <coughs> like, type in Y, just like that, into the chat for me. So in that way I can see that you guys have taken your action, like, your turns. Alright. Okay. Thank you. Uh, okay. This is so, like, we don't get fucking confused. Alright. Alright, I know what I'm gonna do. Alright. Who's going first? Goes... I can go first. Alright. Okay, I'm gonna cast a uh, blinding dwarf over um, over Midas's head. All right then, cast blinding dwarf. Okay. So what that does is it creates a mini, like a tiny sun that flits around its head, uh, dealing one d four fire damage and subtracting one d four from their attack rolls. Rock and roll. And so, I'm now going to be placing. I guess. It's also um, a time based spell rather than a concentration based spell. Yeah, I guess that will work. So it has a duration of two minutes. Alright, fantastic. Wow! That's 20 rounds. Is it concentration? No, it's just a duration. It's just duration. Right, that's correct. Don't worry, it it's going away in three rounds because I'm. 
planning on uh, doing something else. All right, got it. So, All right. Uh, ooh, actually. So I okay. believe uh, I have to make a. I deal one damage. You deal one singular damage to Midas. Yep. Got it. Yep. Ah, it hurts. You actually did damage to me. The, the real big effect is I get a or there was like no reaction. Holes. Yeah, that's true. But now he can feel it. All right, whose turn is next? Also, Sam, uh, is that your turn? Or yep. Okay. Yep, that's all. I'm putting a Y on. Thank you. All right, who's next? Uh, Rudy, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, then I guess I'm going next. Oh, I should probably go next so I can summon the rabbits. Oh, wait, uh, oh, you're making the pen. Yes, make the pen. Do it. It will cook his ass. Hold up. I'm assuming I don't have to fucking... Yeah, you don't have to roll. It's just a automatic thing. I'll make the, uh, can you... Do you want to make the barrier, or... Do you want me to? I forgot how to do the thing. You know, so, uh, right next, to the, right underneath the hand, uh, there's a like a, uh, like a pen, almost. Just click on that, and yeah. Uh -huh. Actually, to be safe, do you want me to just summon the rabbits and then you create the barrier so that I know how uh, where to put the rabbits? Actually, yeah, that's probably a better idea. All right. So, where are you placing the rabbits, Will? Alright, let me, let me actually ping the spell first, show that I'm using it. Oof. Marshmallow Warren. Alright, got it. Wait, All right. oh wait, hold on. Uh, I think you forgot about a certain companion in here. I mean, wait a minute. You're creating a pen, or are you, like, blocking this off? Because you could look here to see that, uh, someone's still very close. I mean, you could block... Well, actually, you know, yeah, you're right. They, he could block. Hold on. Hold it. So... Did Jesse already use his turn? No, Jesse has not used his turn. Jesse! Why is Jesse down there? Uh, he was down there trying to put a box uh, in the uh, the hook in a box. Excellent. And uh, yeah, that whole shebangle happened. Well, there's really no point of putting the hook in a box. I could like kick the box over and like drag the hook in, but yeah. Uh, oh. Yep. I mean, it's, it's better than nothing. <laughs> it's better than touching it. <laughs> yeah. All right, Jesse. Um, you you might be locked in a pen with an explosive. Do you have block? <laughs> I have glacial wall that I can do. That's a okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What do you what do you mean he's locked in with explosive? I can wrap the chain barriers like exclusively around him. Oh, around Midas? Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, but the bunnies do take up five feet each. Very small. I'll just okay. move back here. I mean, like, I want to technically, I'll you, yeah. I'll allow you to create a. I'll allow you to create an explosive pen. Yeah, I can just I move yeah, back here. Yeah, yeah. How about we just, like, delay the turn so that Jesse can get out of there? And... No, no. I can just get right here and cast Glacial Wall right here. Like, okay. right here. Alright, you want to cast Glacial Wall? Go right ahead. Yes. I'm gonna fit one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and I think, yeah, eight right here. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Yes. I think that's my turn. I've created my wall. I can't do anything else. Alright. 
it's time. So when However, we I still want to. I. I still do want to leave like a, the smallest opening into the wall. Yeah, because we need fire in there. Because I have a start the oven. That's true. We do need fire. Uh, so yeah, there, you can you can leave one small hole on it. That yeah, I just want to leave a small hole in there. For oh, next turn. that only takes one SP. I can do like another spell after this. Yeah. All right. Anyway, Nick, you still here? Uh, Nick, I guess left. So. Next muted right now. Yeah. yeah. To be expected. All right. So I believe. Uh, and all right, Jesse did his turn. Miss Alay is going to go. She is going to move. Okay, that's not. Okay. She's gonna move up here to twenty feet. And then shoot a pistol shot at this dude here. All right, a two. That misses. Hey, how long it? Uh, Sean, quick question. Mm -hmm. How long uh, is one turn in like time? Oh, an entire round of combat is six seconds. Is it? Okay, well, this is gonna be abusable. Yeah. It is very abusable. Yeah. Magic is no joke. It's very fucking strong. I love magic. It's no, I, I no, I mean, what's about to happen to Midas is not gonna be exactly fair. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. Alright. Now, it is their turn. After seeing their captain be basically about to get, uh, hotboxed, a whole bunch of them are just like, oh, fuck nah, and start bum-rushing. This skeleton runs up and is going to try to push you. I need you to make a, uh, competing athletics check. Push who? You. Me? Yes. Okay, so here's the funny thing. I still have not used my familiar. Oh. Okay. Can I just like wrap? Can I just like wrap him up as a reaction? Uh, no. But you can use a reaction to try to block the blow with your familiar. I feel yeah, been happening. I guess I'll do that. All right. Uh, in that case, it'll be rolling it against the familiar's athletics. I, I Wait, what's happening? Three. So, yeah, that's... There's no way, there's literally no way I don't. Yeah. Unless I literally roll a one. Yeah. Yo, Sean, what Yeah, happened? there's physically no... Yo, I'm uh, I, forgot, I forgot about the Grim Archery. Yeah. Sean. I don't... Okay, so Nick, while you were gone, I domain expansion Midas, and now he's stuck in a room. Domain uh, expansion? Yeah, he, uh, he's about to get hotboxed by bunnies. Bunnies. Yes. By the way, if he's making an attack roll, he has a reduce his reduced attack. Remember. Who? This guy? Uh, Midas. Oh no, you're talking about that guy. I was thinking about. Uh, oh no, yeah, Midas. Midas. Yeah, no, Midas is kind of. He might genuinely be cooked. So wait, what? What was it? What was it? What was it? Between Arrow and Willie, what was that? What was it? What was it? Okay, combat? so. William put bunnies inside of there, and he's locked in the room. There's a small opening, and next turn I'm going to use fire breath to just detonate everything in there. Bruh. And best part is, combat, like each turn is only six seconds, and the wall lasts for a minute. Yep. Mm. So he's stuck in there I'm for about the fact. next, how many turns? Got an effect on him for twenty rounds. Yeah. So how much health does he have now, though? Midas. Uh, he's still full. We haven't yeah. done it yet. This is the uh, first turn enemy phase. Hmm. All right. All right. I'm listening. I'm listening. Keep on going. Yeah. Uh, I believe it's concentration, though. Uh, the walls. 
Yep. Concentration. All right. Do you want me to tell you what concentration needs? I have to not get hit. Yeah. Have to focus on the. Yeah. You know? Yes. That's that's indeed correct. Got it. it the save. Fun. When you get hit, you have to make a save. That is either ten or half the damage you took, whichever one's higher. Uh, yeah. All right. If you fail at spell ends. Yeah. Anyways, now. So, Nick, it's your turn because that uh, you you haven't taken your turn yet. Ooh, Nick, I'm going to politely ask that you safeguard me until Midas dies. Yeah. Um, Pretty please with the cherry on top. Um. Mm, I think about that, Noah. Gotta think about that real hard. Okay, I thought about it. Sure. Thought about it, he says after <laughs> like 10 seconds. All right. I mean, it's not much I can really do since I already put this man in a, in a domain expansion. There were six I... other dudes. There were six other... Wait, what do you mean there were six other dudes? Skeletons? Yes. Yeah, six other skeletons, yeah. There's one nearby right now. Yeah, who tried to push. I... Um... Oh, okay. I'm gonna attack that guy then. All right. The one that's. Hold the hit. I I can't use my computer. Oh, right. right now. Uh, what are you attacking with? Strong blow. All right. It's a 15. Blow his. It's a 15 plus one. Plus. Wait, that's plus strength, right? Um, it's plus strength modifier and. Okay, that's plus three, plus two, that's five, All right. so... Alright, that's a 20. Yeah, that hits. Uh, roll for damage. Roll for damage? Yep. Me? Roll for damage? Oh, right, yeah. Uh, how much damage <laughs> am I supposed to roll? Um, it's out of six. So, like, yeah. Try to roll, like, six D6. dice. Four, um, four D6, got it. Four D6, mm-hmm. Nine. You land one hell of a blow. But these guys are yeah. odd. For starters, you don't push them back like you're used to. No, he's still standing even though you punched him directly in the face. These ones are tougher than the ones you fought before. What, what what's so different about them? They're naturally more sturdy. Do they have like armor on or something? No, it's just they're oh, they... more sturdy. Okay, they're built they're both... different. Yeah. They dr they drink more milk. Yeah, they drank way more milk before this. Okay, that's not good. Well, and who knows? They might have milk on them. Hey yo, really? <laughs> hey yo, Nick, <laughs> drain him of his milk right now. Hell no! <laughs> Wait a minute. Wait. So am I? Is that is that my turn? Is that all I can that's, do? That's it. Strong blow is your full action. All right. Well. All right. Now it's everyone else's turn. So this guy, I don't believe he has a good sight. No, that would cause disadvantage. Uh, he can't exactly move, so he's going to move over here. Try to... Don, please try not to make this difficult. I, I have to. I want to be done fighting skeletons. I, that's a good point, that's a good point, that's a good point. He's gonna wait here, and he's going to prepare something. This one over here notices you, and is going to shoot his musket. It's a 16. Does that hit? Well, 16 plus 2. That's an 18. Does that hit? Who's that aimed at? That's you... aimed at you. This feels like targeted harassment. But yes, that I don't know. Maybe the fact is. that you're the one who is keeping their, I'm assuming, boss. Hey, maybe you would All right, so not judge. Like, hey, listen. piercing damage. As the so shot, to... yeah, you have to roll a saving throw. It has to be, um, you have to basically make it above a 10. 
And uh, I'm. What the hell do I roll for this? I believe it's your spellcasting modifier. Yes. Yeah. Well, it's uh, it's a wisdom save. Wisdom save. Why would it be wisdom? That based off charisma. Well, Google this again to make sure. Constitution. Oh. Oh. God. Interesting. That's fine. Okay. Oh. Roll. Uh, what dice do I roll? Uh, like a twenty? Uh, yeah, it's a d twenty. It's oh, a Constitution 10? saving throw. Yeah. It's a d twenty. So I literally need. Does the bonus count? Yes. Okay, then I literally just need to roll above a two. And yeah, it's a 20. 20. Of, all, of, all time, of all times to get a nat 20. Yep. You grit your teeth as the shot shoots into your arm. You grit your teeth, still holding on strong the concentration on this barrier. The boy's about to cry. <laughs> it, 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 like, out of all the times to get a 20. He's going to try to make a... Well, he's, he's going to be in the bush. Right. This dude is going to try to shoot you, Alay. Oh, I'll, I'll tear. Uh, do I have cover? No. It looks like there's things over here that would be cover. Actually, now you stream don't. <laughs> <laughs> right now. That's uh, fair. All right, that's a three. Fuck. <laughs> no, can you stream? I'm kind of disabled right now. All right. I'll, uh, <laughs> I mean, I'm streaming on Twitch, but okay. Okay, I'll look on Twitch. I mean, no, no, I got it. I got their Discord. Oh my god, can I find you the music now? Sean D. Joe Star. No, I can't hear the music through the stream. So sad. Wait. Wait, what? I'll do your Discord stream. Can't oh, hear the Discord stream. Yeah. Right. Right. Gibbity gibbity goo. Yep. All right. Now, ooh, so fuck. bro, we're so uh, compact. This dude is going to come over here and then is going to try to die. Is going to try to cut you, McFinnigan, with two sword slashes. All right. So that's an eighteen and a four. Okay, the eighteen hits. The four does not. All right. That's a. Uh, that's a three in slashing damage. Oh, I took three damage. For shame. Holy shit. You are rolling really terribly. Yeah, Thank you. One last one left. He is going to <coughs> go over here and pull out a blunderbust. Oh. Excuse me. Ah. Uh. Alright. So, luckily for you, well, you're out of the way. But for these two... Yes, because you're still going to target me. Oh, no, you're out of the way. Like, you're fine. But these two... Both of you must make Nick. a save. So, me and Nick. Yes. Alright. You have to remember, you have to roll for Nick still, so... Right, yep. Well, can I block? I actually cannot block. Uh, yeah. I don't. Uh, I'm not sure if you got a block of blunderbust, buddy. But okay. I'm gonna block a bun a blunderbust. All right. I got a 14, right in the middle. All right. Fantastic. All right. You want to block? So. I want to block. It's still going to be a deck save, but you do get to add uh, a bonus to the save. So. 18. That the wall neck is fine. Yeah. Plus, if I dodge, the one behind me is going to have to get shot too, right? Yeah. So that's, that's so a very good point. Yeah. You basically just save Noah's son of skin. Fantastic. Uh, you, um, so, Will, you'll take the full damage. And Nick, you'll take half damage. Ooh, wee. Oh. Uh, 11 piercing damage. Oh, that's, that's so much worse. Eleven. That's gonna be about. Just, bam. 5. I'm at two HP. <laughs> uh. 
Oh, I'm that's in trouble. unfortunate. I'm in danger. All right, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> oh boy. Y'all know, bro. Make some candy. <laughs> Do something to heal yourself. Yeah, I'll just blow some chin gum in people's faces. All right. So, so anyway, did you know you can buy Arkham Asylum for two dollars? I'll be back in a minute. No, I did not. Uh, is that promotion still going on? Uh, it's called Fire Dink. Why? What? I'm not actually oh. part. Okay, so oh, this is a website gosh. where you buy. It, it, it it's one website where you can buy like the games like codes on Steam, like like gift codes from. And I bought Arkham Asylum in Ark Arkham City for like two dollars. But anyway, Rudy, what are you saying about your plan? Uh. I was just making a joke plan that I was just gonna chew some bubble gum and gunk up their bones. Make a parfait and heal yourself to full. Alright. So, uh, Will, what are you at? Are you bloody? I am at 2 HP. Jesus! Well, ele that was 11 damage. That was, that was a lot. I don't have much. I know. I'm level 2, I don't have much health. But that is the last of my turn. So, all right. It's now your guys' turn. So, Sean, okay. Let me just confirm. Oh, you wait, have look. Midas. Yes, Midas. What is he doing? Oh, he could fight the bunnies. That, yeah, that is a great point. Yes, he can he indeed fight, fight my the rabbits. Bunnies. As he's going to use the ability of, I believe, Cyclone. I believe that's what I called it. Blade Cyclone. Yep. No, don't blender my rabbits. <laughs> uh, don't worry, it's only gonna make it worse when he fans the flames. Can I real quick confirm something? Uh, you have taken a look at um, my spells since I've added the Black Hole spell, right? Uh, I have, what? I don't have a lot of them off the top of my head. Because I added that a while ago, and I'm confirming this because... There are some uh, natural thing that will be useful in I'll, around. I'll take a look at it, but please describe it. Okay, so essentially the gist of it is it eats my spells I have out on the field, um, combines their damage and range, and then when enemies are too close to the center of the area, um, it sucks them closer to the center. Right? Oh, that, yeah, I know that's well. Yeah. Okay, cool. I'm just confirming that because, um, there are some natural, um, natural hazards. Hazards? Yes, I'm well aware. Okay. I was just confirming because I've, I, I AoE, and um, yeah. shit like that. Yeah, you can hit your uh, I just wanted to make sure. So yeah. Well, yeah, you can, but they also are less stupid than yeah. skeletons. True. Uh, Will, or at least they are literally numbskulls. Will, can you please make yeah. saving? Can you please make deck saving uh, uh, for all of the bunnies? For all eight of the bunnies. Yes. Okay. I'll just, I'll just roll a bunch of d20s. You can roll eight d20s. Hey. A lot of them fail, I would imagine. Yeah, uh, only two of them succeed. Wait, well, only two? Oh, sorry, what is the DC 16? Yeah. Oh. Uh oh, okay. Nick wants to release from you. Oh, wait, hold okay, on. Okay, only. No, it's not. Uh, so actually, it's three of them that uh, survive. Okay, three survive. Survive? Uh, or at least well, hold on. Brother, you have a. Do the happen. damage. Uh, oh, yeah. So... yeah. Yeah, that is. Whoa. How much HP do they all have? Nine. Got it. That's like the most shit way. How did the Ender Guard kill you? Okay. What? Damn. 
That's 12 <laughs> okay, plus... Okay, so three survive. What? So 12 plus four, so that's 16. So you add your strength modifier to that? Oh, God. All right. 16. That's actually... Oh, crazy. Jesus Christ. All right. So, uh, we have three bunnies left to cook him with. It does. What about... Okay, I can't burn the corpses? Uh, they don't. Well, you could burn the corpses. They'll do like, like a region fire damage, so we could cook them on slow. Yeah. But they don't explode. Yeah. Okay. Well. That's that's just a balancing through. thing. Yeah. And that will take us full turn. Yeah. He just blended my rabbits. Anyway, there you go. Before anything else happens. All right. Fire breath. Like to move closer, and then fire back. <laughs> like to move exactly one square, actually. Hell yeah! So I can get point blank rage and fire breath in that small oh, hold area. Hold on, hold on a second. So, dog, he the skeleton already did its turn. That's true, it's, but there's a thing called don't you, reaction. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It can react to me moving away. Yes. That's the same. That's yeah, it's called an opportunity attack. attack. That's the same with anybody. Yeah. You can as well. So if this guy was to go over here, bam, bam, and like, like all three of you guys would be like all three of us would bam. smack him. Yeah. So ganging up on the motherfucker ain't no joke. Okay. Whoa. Bam. Give me a second, then. What do you think? All right. Can my familiar do a snake chain at him while I move? To try to knock him away? Just to distract him so I have time to get over there. Or, I'm on. oh wait, you could use another character to uh, shove you towards the, uh... the cage. Because forced movement ignores opportunity attacks. That's true. Yes, Nick's talking through chat, by the way. Oh, shit. I yes, uh, like, type. I have not been seeing that. Well, he just put it in chat, so... Got it. I know, I know what I'm gonna do, if I can just go ahead and do that. Right. So basically, you wanna push Noah closer to the cage so he does not get hit. Note, that will take up your turn. It's worth it, trust. Or you could just take... I mean, it depends on how much... Like, what type of thing it is. Also, it's only a melee attack that they can make if they only have range. Like, I want... Uh, it actually is worth... So long as they the rabbits blow up, we do... You will end up doing more damage than just punching the skeleton. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they want, they want you to yeah, punch... So you, should, you should totally... Totally, like, put, push me towards the cage, you know? That'd be great. Just tell me your athletics check, and I'll make the roll for you. Get yeeted. And plus side, you get to yeet Sparrow. Yeah. Mm hmm So the answer is yes. Alright. Mm -hmm. Alright, there we go. Okay. Tell me your tell me your athletics bonus. He can't get on the site. Fine, fantastic. Uh, well, you can. Well, nine. it's a nine, and no one could easily just choose to fail. So, what? You're not close. Choose not to risk death. Yeah. And so now, I can fire directly into it. I wish the explosions too. Uh, uh the explosions. Let me pull it out. Like, I don't want to hear any bullshit excuse that. Yes, he's going to dodge an explosion while he's in a cage. Oh, fuck no. Nah, fuck no. Nah. But perhaps making an oven, an explosive oven, with a small hole isn't the wisest decision. Well, I mean, like... I mean, it is... I have to rather, get fire and... Would you rather I have to get that fire in there somewhere. True. Come on. Yeah, you have to get fire in there somewhere. And plus... If there wasn't an exit, 
there's no place for that energy to go, so it's got to create a place. That's true. That's very true. That's very and you, assuming. Alright. Oh, like, I'm assuming my own fire wouldn't do me that bad. That's true. You also. I, I would have survived somewhat fire resistant. Yeah, you would also. But I will say this after you blow, you must make a deck save. Bad. <laughs> What? <laughs> that is perfectly reasonable. Yeah. I I eat those. What? Yeah. Roll dex. Roll dex save. On a fail, you get hit with your own flames. On a win, you don't. Ten. Well, I'm on. That's a ten. We we eat those. Oh, uh, what's the bonus? Dexterity. Let's see. Uh, plus five. Add proficiency. All right. Let me see. Fifteen. Yeah, that, that I'm gonna say that works. And, uh, how much damage is dealt to Midas? Uh, how much did the explosions do? The fire thing, and then I'll, I'll do the explosives. Alright, so, how about you roll for fire breath first? Yeah. I don't know how much damage it does, you never told me. Yeah, uh, it's a d8. It's, I know, it's very weak. It's 1d8 plus, uh, blue moves con, but in this case I'm gonna make it dex. Five plus three, that's eight. Eight fire damage. And then what about the explosions afterwards? Uh so showing I'm on your uh, Midas uh you're saying that Midas uh is guaranteed to take this damage. Yes. So like Okay, well I'm just gonna roll it then. Alright, he takes nineteen fire damage. Nineteen extra and... fire damage on top of the eight he was dealt so yeah and on top of that he's gonna be burning for a few rounds yeah so yeah they, they wait how much HP does he have again uh ooh, well he is weakened now so you don't actually know how tough he is now but before it's fair to say he's not as well he Shun literally just said that he's not that tough anymore, so we could kill him. We got him. We got him okay last time. Yeah. As flames. Yeah, but that's like 20, 27 damage he just took. Yeah. You hear him screaming in agonizing pain and in anger. As he's being cooked alive. Or cooked undead? Eh. Roast skeleton, yummy. Yeah. Mmm. Cooked bone marrow. Mmm. My dog loves that. Actually, bone marrow is really fucking good. You eating bone marrow? Yeah. What? God. Honestly, that doesn't even surprise me that much. Yeah, it's me you're talking to. Hello, did I survive? Yeah, you survived. The chain barrier combined with your ice wall, you barely felt anything at all. But you do feel the heat from it. Oh, nice. Yeah. So, both of you have ended your turns. Can you, uh, or at least... Uh, yeah, so... Yeah, why? Chris, why? Thank you. All right, along with... Nick. I'm gonna type in Y for Nick. Alright. Now it is all now it is I, I have a real quick turn. Yep. I have a really quick turn. Okay, uh first I get to do two D four damage to him because one of my Grimoire things is an extra damage die. Oh no. <laughs> Bro, you're cooking him. You're just straight up cooking him. A one and a three, so a total of four damage. Lovely. Um. So that is. Let me see the total of this. So that is. 8, 19, that's 27. Uh. No. No, yeah, 27 plus 4, 3? I dealt 4 damage to him. 4, so that's 41. 41 fire damage in one turn! Fucking god! Okay. Now I move on to my action. 
Uh, where I'm gonna cast White Dwarf. Um, gonna... Okay, let's see. Uh, that... will... Get... I want him to do it. Remind slightly. me of what White Dwarf does. Oh, it's really simple. All it does is it... Um... It deals 1d4 damage to everyone within a 10-foot radius whenever they start or end their turns in the radius. Oh, fucking god. It's, so, technically 2d4, because I have the bonus die. Yep. Damn. Um, which... That ends my turn. Jesus. Okay, then. Remember to press Y. Type him yep. Thank you. Now, Mick Finnegan, it's your turn. Yeah. Okay. After the last oh, time Finnegan did, I don't didn't think you would be so excited for it. Throw more started. bunnies into the pit. Mm. More explosives. I mean, I could. You really could. But you I are, really could. But you're kind I of am at two. <laughs> you're at two HP. And you can get gangbanged at any given moment. <laughs> and we also don't have our uh, resident person who heals. Yep. We do not have a resident person who heals, and I am surrounded. I have I, a little I, bit actually, of healing, but I have I'm no being, spell points to do it. Actually, I'm being flanked right now yeah. by these two fuckers. So they're going to have advantage on ganking me. Yeah. So I'm getting the fuck out of there. I'm going to disengage and move away. And then, next round, I'll start doing more bunnies. Because they're going to be burning for a few rounds. Got right, it. How much movement? I have 35 feet. Might as well use all of it. <laughs> Get me out of there. Alright. Lovely. And oh, that's my turn. Because right. I can't do anything you else. Done your turn. Oh, oh yes, I can. You do. Never mind. Okay. What can I do? <laughs> I'm just gonna. Be, oh, shit. I'm gonna be very polite, um, and say, well, this here, I'm gonna count as an exit for you. And you can uh, climb so up. You, yeah, no, yeah. Bro, you he's just stuck move. between you a. Move he's stuck between a rock and a hard place. Okay. All right, just give me. Mm, yeah. mm. Okay. Just gonna just kinda move onto this rock. Alright. Now what are you gonna do? Alright, I'm looking at my spells right now. Seeing what I can do. Frostbite is something that I can do. Alright, I'm gonna catch. Well, uh, Altair, you can move to allow him to make that shot. I will. I'll move a bit. Alright. Alright, All right. I'm gonna cast Frostbite on this guy. Gonna make a ranged spell attack. Right. Remind me, what does Frostbite do again? And how much damage does it deal? Okay. You create a crocodile's head made of ice and fling it at one creature within range. Make a spell, range spell attack against the target on hit. The target takes 1d10 piercing damage. Hit or miss, the shard then explodes the target. And each creature within 5 feet of it must, must make... Must succeed on a dexterity saving throw or take 2d6 cold damage. Ah. Got it. So basically... It's kind of like a bomb that you throw at somebody's head. Yeah, uh, roll the hit. Alright, brother. Uh, plus, I guess proficiency... Wait, do you get profic proficiency in yeah. spell attacks? Yes. Okay, plus proficiency and almost in constitution. Constitution? And... 
Oh yeah, spellcasting modifier. Oh, what? I didn't. Um, did I make your spell cast at casting modifier constitution? I think you just let us choose. I, think... I, I said out of one of your mental stats. Oh. Yeah, you said out of willpower, uh, charisma, I think intelligence. It's wisdom, intelligence. charisma, and intelligence. Oh, then I guess charisma plus two. Right. Yeah. Uh, so that's <laughs> plus four. That's a fifteen. That hits. Hey. Give me a second. Why do I hear Splatoon? I heard Splatoon sounds. Who's playing Splatoon? That's not Splatoon. That was my mother's alarm. All right. So Fair ten point. Ten damage. Whoa, that's a good damage hit. As your magical spell just guides the air. Or. Lovely. Uh, everyone has to make a deck save? Yep. Everyone? Or everyone within, within five your feet. range. That's five for the one you got hit, and then that's. Well, that's seven, fourteen for the guy who de uh, dodged. It, does the fourteen succeed? Yes, I think so. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright. Alright, 2d6. Woo! Rolling some high damage numbers, man. Jesus Christ. So that is a total of. Whoosh! That's 19 damage dealt to one of the skeletons. It is beyond the realms of bloodied. This guy, on the other hand, takes only half that damage, correct? Yeah. So he's still fine. I got him! And it, uh, can you press, uh, uh, please type in Y in the chat to show that you are done with your turn. Alright. I should do so. Me. Alright. Rock and roll. It is now Miss Lay's turn. Miss Lay is going to go over to you and make and heal. Make a medicine check to try to heal you. Oh dang! I took damage. <laughs> I took damage. No, uh, McFinnigan. I know that's making it dope. All right. Oh. So that's ten plus five. 15. Uh, Sick. I'm gonna say that succeeds. That's not how much you heal. Come on. Oh. Heal 6. Come on. Yeah, what's six hurt? Health. Damn. <laughs> Wait, hold on. When did I get hurt? <laughs> how much did I get hurt for? You didn't get I, hurt I'm the one who's hurt. I, I'm hurt. Well, I am now exactly bloody. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm dumb. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm dumb. It's alright, dude. We're all a little bit kind of fuzz brains. Yeah. Alright, now it's their turn. This skeleton is going um, to... Oh. They take damage. Yep, so this one, this one... Three, the four of them. Yeah. Take how much? Take 2d4. 2d4. A one and a four, so five damage. Five damage to all of them. This guy is yep. now dead. Whoa! This guy, hurt, is going to leave the circle along with this guy, and this guy leaving what he made here. And actually, this dude's gonna fucking book it away from here. As I think I can hear, move it in a way that would still put them in my range. As you hear it sizzling. Is it a bomb? Yes. Is it? it is a bunch of explosives as it <laughs> explodes, striking the ceiling. Luckily, nearly everyone's out of the way of it. Except, Who's not? Except for the ceiling. As you hear mm. it crack open, as water begins to slowly yeah. drip Turn back. to the ground. 
Mm, this place fun. is about to flood. Fun, 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 fun. So you have an estimated Stop. two rounds until this story that you guys are on is now flooded. Good thing I can... Ooh. Yes? You know what? You said something? You are, like... Well, I'm like, sort of the plan here. Listen, my job is to make combat hard. And besides, this will also fuck up No, it's ass. not. Your job is to make it fun. Also true. Also true. Um... Alright. Now they are going to try to... Instead of attacking you guys... This dude... And this one over here... Oh, hold on. Father... Ugh. Are going to try to... Where'd the bridge go? Get the fuck out. Although this guy is instead actually going to try to attack you, Altair. Oh, fun. Why are they- wait, 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 why are they attempting to leave? Because remember, it's flooding. Oh. Okay, but why should that matter to them? They're skeletons. That is a very fair statement. I mean- They can't drown. Sure, they can't drown, but do you want to be trapped in here forever? Very clearly, Yo, they can't be trapped in here forever. Midas. Like, honestly, my, yeah, like, last they time... Are, they actually they are, are abandoning Midas. That is weird. Or is it? As yeah, they, they, boys. They up, as they move up here, they pull out a very particular device as, a ha as they Hello? pull out... Is it Midas hand. still on fire, by the way? Yes. Yeah. Mice is on oh, fire burning in a slow cooker right now. As they pull out a hand cannon. Wait, Sean. Yep. Sean. We got wait, did y'all skip my turn, bro? Uh no. Uh, we have not. Is in enemy phase right now, Nick. They're going to shoot a hand cannonball to try to blow up the wall. Or more specifically, at you. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw. Either oh, way you're and, hit. And who? At me. Nick. Oh. Noah. Wow. Well, technically both of you guys, since they're shooting at you. That's fun. Are we balling? We are big balling right now. Oh, also the skeleton is in that range. That's true, that's a very good point. 16, that is a success. You do only take half the damage. Seven, damn. That sucks. But I still need you to make a constitution saving throw. Wait? Yes, you would only take half Wait, the damage. Wait, so I'd take half... Half of seven would be, are you doing three or four? Uh, I like to round it down for you guys, so... You got you only three. three. Okay. Well, so that looks like a lot like a head. Another nat 20 for the save. Oh, Amazing. We love to see it. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well. He's not getting him today. Jeez, uh, for fuck's sakes. Uh your con you and your concentration is unmatched, dog. Like, what the fuck? <sighs> hey, Sean, that actually sounds like a really nice, um, grimoire thing. Something around concentration checks. I would probably make that, that a thing. It, it already is a thing. You can oh, yeah. add your spellcasting mod to your con along concentration checks. I have it. Yeah. Oh, nice. I didn't know that. Sorry, didn't mean by anything I haven't, like that. I haven't looked at that stuff in it's a while. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. While. Because we haven't had to level up in a while. Alright, so... Yeah, it's uh, called Magical Vitality. Now, I hope we get a level up. That was only up. one of these guys. The other one's going to still take a... Going to still try to shoot you. Bullshit. 
Okay. Nine. Does that hit? Let me check. Wait, does it? If it's the same thing, does it matter? Like, uh, yeah, does it, it be, it, need to be higher or lower? It has to be equal to or higher. Okay, we're chilling. It's the same, we're chilling. For it to hit. Doesn't it? Yeah, for it to hit. My AC, right? Yes. Yeah, we're chilling. Doesn't it? It's your AC. 16. Yes. It, so. it has to be equal to or higher than. Oh, I thought you meant for me to dodge it. Okay, my fault. No. It has to be below your AC. So, take seven piercing damage. Make another, yeah. concent make another uh, concentration check. We still chilling. We are vibing. Damn. Yep. That still works. Oh, yeah, you still succeed. Shit. You are like... You are truly showing off your will. Also, by the way, when you get off, when you get to half HP, uh, if you could say bloody, that would be handy. All right. Thank you. All right. Both of these guys got hit. Uh, these two. This one's going to try to attack you, Altair. Let's see here. Ooh. That's a miss. Fuck. The other one's gonna try to do it. That's not a miss. That's a hit. What? Is, oh, yep, it is. It's gonna get up close. I don't remember. Dice one. Four. I Grrr. think four damage. Yeah, four slashing. All right, and I believe this is concentration, right? White dwarf. Uh, yeah, it is. Yep, yeah, hot zone. All right. Well, uh, that is a 13, plus my constitution, so plus two. Alright. Oh well, this is just what happens. And, uh, next is Midas' turn. Uh, Doesn't he take damage from the doing what? Still being on fire and stuff? Yeah. He's gonna be on fire. Didn't you so, say he was screaming in pain earlier? Yes, he is. But he's still gonna- he still has a turn. Unfortunate. Yep. Alright, so how much fire damage would this deal? Uh... So, how much- what would the damage I- it was a d6, right? Yeah. D6, so... Three... I'm gonna say he takes- d6? Three d6. Fire damage to him. Eleven more fire damage. As he's Sean. Yeah. Bro has taken over fifty damage. Yes. He's a fucking end game. He's, he's a boss. Yeah. Nothing we have fought uh, this far had more than twenty HP. I think. Yeah. Um, okay, we didn't even kill the kraken. We induced an the kraken. idea of what DMing for monsters is. Uh, you usually um, uh, there are like six of us, and we got one boss. So you're gonna have to balance out the kind of weak scrubs that go down easy with the boss who just doesn't go down that easy. Yeah. And I mean, we did do a lot of damage to him. So, who wants a boss that goes down in two rounds? Me. I do. I mean, we do. Yeah, I do not give a fuck. You're not getting a boss that goes down in two rounds. Okay, I'm but a, like, we, this we is want, like, we cooperation. Done, but it's kind of boring. If we do it that fast. Dude, you locked him in a box before his turn even began. Good. <laughs> Deserved. Yo, I have a great plan. I did a whole two damage to him the one time I did hit him. Yeah. And now that he's weaker, you can actually deal with him. Uh, like, it should be reasonable for me to want him to die as soon as possible. 
That's true, that's true. But don't expect him to die easily. Sean? Yeah? How much HP does he have? Any little progress bar, at the very least. Uh, let me check how much total HP he has. So, you nearly got unbloodied. You're fucking with me. Listen, he's not gonna be able to get out of that box until you lower your, <laughs> your go until you lower your concentration. So you're fine. And hell, you can continue to attack him inside the box. That is the, the that is the plan. Uh, keep in mind, he's also gonna like in two rounds be drowned. Drowning, I obviously don't mean actually drowning. Yeah, the fire will be put out in two rounds, so you can try to deal as much fucking damage as humanly possible, or try to get the fuck out. <laughs> Did I ever say anything about- I don't think we have enough movement. Do we have enough movement to get out? You can try make- you can try a dashing. Dashing takes up your full action. Um, and it makes it so that you double your movement speed. Uh, but monks, I believe, can expend a key to dash as a bonus action. Yeah. They can dash as a bonus action. Yeah, I don't think we're getting out like two turns. That's true. Only the first story, the one you're on, will be getting the flood. Which means the fire will be put out, but everything will become difficult terrain, causing it to be, you know... Hard to traverse. There is another way out over here. Yeah, I was gonna say through there. Yeah. You can climb up there to try to get across. Which might be your best bet. Uh, do y'all wanna book it? I mean, we could. I have a plan and it's that stupid. What is your plan? Well, so you know how I was telling you about that black hole spell? I'm gonna just start trying to suck them into the, um, pool of water beneath us. It, that doesn't sound like that stupid of a plan. It isn't, but the problem it is... Eh, there's not really that much of a problem with it. Um... Anyway. Try to cut this shit quickly. All right, we got we gotta finish the combat. I know, also, after I know. the combat, will we get will we get a level? It's a big boss fight. Shut the fuck up. Anyways, uh, mine has <laughs> ended this turn along with the rest of this group. It is now your turn. All right. Um, I'll go first because I already did my pen. Plan. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna cast my black hole. Right. Okay. So what that does is it cancels all of my spells, mm -hmm. and the damage is combined of both of them. So 44. Um, the range is added up and divided by 2 add 5, so it's the same uh, radius as my Wait. other spell. Because that I already have, so I'm just gonna use the same circle. Um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm going to, uh, going to spawn it, like, here. Actually, no, I'm gonna spawn it over here, because I want that guy to be pulled away from me. Who? Where? Oh, the one, I want the one right in front of me to be pulled away from me, so I can move without, um, that, so it gets sucked Five feet closer to the center. All right, you could. Same with the other dude. It. Yep. So one of them's in the center, which actually doesn't do anything for uh, while they're alive. Um, they both take forty-five d four damage because of the additional damage. So I'm actually gonna roll that. This so. Our. Let's see if I actually remember the thing. Plus one.
Did I do it right? See it. Press enter? I can't see anything. C4. I want five of them. There we go. Okay, that's gonna be 13 damage because I add one. Alright, one of them was already really hurt, and the other one was decently hurt. But I'm gonna count- I'm going to count this as one of them dying. The one in the, uh, dead fucking center is now- Okay. Kaplamo, as the other one is now- So, blade. it gets sucked into the center of it, and I add another one damage to it. The, um, thing. Upon death, it gets spewed out of the- Upon the end of the spell, it gets spewed out of the middle, but, um... Yeah. Got it. Uh, and then, I have a movement... 30 feet, so I'm going to, um... 5... Actually, you're right, I can measure that. Um... We're going up. No, you will have to climb the- you will have to climb this. Yeah, climbing is fine. I can climb. Right. It'll- it'll be fine. But, like, I gotta leave. Um... Oh yeah, and... What's his name's Their star. So... Huh? Um... Midas is no longer affected by my other star. Alright, that's one thing he has- oh, that's one last thing he has to worry about. The water begins to rise up, as it's really close to spilling in. By the way, the area of the black hole is counted as difficult terrain. Okay, yeah. Um, uh, alright, so... And... that's... Nick. Me all done. I know. Uh, hold on, give me a second, let me fix me. You're like, I don't want to do a diagonal. In the meantime, while well, I scurry and find my phone. Next time. We could do that. We could do that. <laughs> except. Except. As soon as Nick is about to throw a punch, you see this. mist wrap around him and he disappears. What? Before oh, Nick is about good, to attack, this strange mist wraps around him as he disappears. Okay, well, I'm just not seeing this in chat, but, uh... Alright, I'll tell you, I'll tell you what you see. You see this, this cape wrap around you it is as you're being pulled away. As you look behind you to see a masked man. Not a not a regular wooden mask, mind you. No. It's a cloth mask with a painting of an eye. A large eye covering a majority of the face. Do not be alarmed. I'm sorry, Nick just got kidnapped. <laughs> Do not be alarmed. I'm here to help. This place is about to flood at any moment. As Nick then later appears over here. Alright, so, Nick, you can throw a rock if you want at, at one of the skeletons to try to kill it. You want to do that? I want to throw a skeleton. Add another skeleton? You know what? Bet, on your way up flying, you grab the dead skeleton that was there previously. Uh, that one's not there. That got sucked into the black hole. Well, fuck. Okay, you grab the other one. <laughs> <laughs> and you can throw it now. Uh, athletic shake is a plus five, right? I'm gonna have to say you throw it at the one that's already bloodied. Yeah, throw it at the one in the black hole, because if yeah. you do hit it, then, um... And it dies. 18. Then I get to add some damage to my. That's it. Oh. I'm gonna say that it's a D8. 
of damage plus two. <laughs> As you fucking yeet its body, it mainly gets sucked into the black hole, but it's it, but it somewhat thwaps this dude in the center. Well, in the center. Oh, like, this slightly this, the... dinks across his head, you know. Okay, I get it. I got guys. I get an extra point of damage to my spell now. It's plus three damage now. Oof. Yeah, we just... Yeesh. The whole point of the spell is so that way I can um, get an extra concentration. I can get more spells out. It basically consumes... It, the whole purpose is to consume my concentration spells and combine them into one thing so I can get an extra concentration spells it's out. nothing to be... Wait, how... Oh, you can double it by uh, dashing, but that does take up all of your action. I was gonna ask how many feet of movement do you get? Uh, 30. 30 plus dex rounded up. Well, rounded. Huh? If we dash, we can just go all the way there then, what? Yeah. Well, if I dash. Yeah, if you dash, you can get all the way there. But you'll but you'll also have to climb, which takes up like 10 movement. Dex mod, typically. Hold on, I thought dashing just doubles your movement speed. Yes, it does. I'm talking about movement speed in general. Your movement speed is uh, determined by um, your by the racial one uh -huh. plus your extra bonuses plus your dex mod rounded to the nearest five. I didn't know that. I have an idea. I mean, so, so some classes okay. have bonuses, like, uh, Monk has bonuses. Yeah, I know that much. Stuff. Which is why I say additional bonuses, it's okay. literally just... I, I, I know, I know, I get it. Alright, yeah? So, what if... We all dash there, I throw a chain up, and Nick just pulls, up, up, pulls us all up. Are you guys down for that? I'm gonna. I'm planning on climbing, but I be the. Yeah. All right. Uh, you've got an old dash to get over there. Feel free. Move. Okay. Three feet. I measured it. That's... All right, I, I believe... Actually, no, this is that's twenty. Wait, no, that's already thirty. True, true. And... So dash is an extra three. Wait, I can just. Yeah. You can also use one of your cantrips. Ooh, I can just move up there. Yeah, and then. Still do the chain up there. Says, Even though that would use up your full action. Alright, also. Chat. I'm gonna actually move the black hole now. Alright. Real quick. You wait, 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 you can move a black hole? That's crazy. I can move my spells, yeah. It's part of their shit. Well, I want oh. it. Not letting me though. Alright. I'm moving it over here. Okay. So that way I can pull things. There we go. Yeah, thanks. So that way, so, so that way, at my next turn, I can just grab them and joint them in. All right. Oh wait. Hmm. You all better get there now, because I just remembered. It's been two rounds since I said that was going to happen. That it was going to flood. I have no more movement. I know. I can swim. Yeah. But 
that's gonna take up like uh, like Why would you want to spawn? This light is going to run up up there. So she can make it to there. I mean, LA can dash. Yeah, miss you said, uh... Dash. You said it's 10 movement to climb. And then yeah. dash, so 60 feet up. So you can just get all the way up. Yeah. There was no other skeleton to grab. That one's in the black hole. Alright. Yeah. Now. Jesse. Jesse. What do you do? Jesse, are you there? Jesse's muted. Lovely. Alright. Will, how about you? Williams also muted. God damn. <laughs> Alright. I'm back. Alright. You're gonna speak over my shoulder? Alright. Alright, what are you gonna do? Everyone's running away because this shit's. Jesse's back. Me. Also, Jesse's finally back. Yippee. 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 Oh my god. I tried doing the yippee and it was horrible. He feels his power leaving him. I'm not quite bloodied yet. You know who is you know who is a mic expert though? Oh, what? So you could try to lower the, like, the actual cage, like the actual cage that you made, and try to make a barrier around here. And just like prevent them from yeah. being able to get out. Yeah, this, this prevent them from escaping. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna position myself so that I can start messing around. I'm gonna start messing up them moving. Five extra feet of movement. I'm gonna go up here. It's our turn, right? Alright, that's my turn. Yep. And Williams is right. his turn. Okay. Jesse, what do you want to do? I'm gonna dash up there. Alright. Can dash? Yep. You can get up to here, I believe. Alright, give me a second. Mm. Take your time. There we go. Alright. Please type in the Y to show that you've ended your turn. And try to hammer this, this into you guys. Thank you. Excuse me. I'm gonna try to wrap this up because I'm really hungry and that fried chicken looks really right. fucking good. Yo, we're also having fried chicken. Hell yeah. Um, Did your mama okay. make yours? Whoa, I'm having- Yeah. Wow, yeah, I'm, I'm having fried fish. Here. Fuck yeah, eating all fried- all sorts of fried okay. shit. Hell yeah. Alright. I'm moving up here. Also, but first- Huh? 
I thought you said it was our turn. You're round. It hasn't. Okay, mm. there. It's now these guys' turn. Yippee. Okay. So these two, uh, I believe, are dealt damage, correct? In the black hole. Hmm. No, yes. it's on my turn. Okay. All right. This dude is gonna get the fuck away. Try to catch up to you guys. He's gonna run up over here, and then try to attack you, Noah. That's a miss. miss. Okay, we okay, chill it. Yeah. yeah. This dude is not gonna be able to make it over to you, so he's gonna run the fuck away. Uh, and Midas is just stuck here, except <laughs> the water. Finally sunken in. I'm still leaving it there. I'm oh, leaving no. the cage there. Yeah, the cage is still there, but the fire isn't. Can I close up the cage before the water gets in? Uh, either way, it's like water will still seep in. It's not a perfect like barrier, mind you. There are holes. It's made of chains. Fair point. So, yeah. This area is now difficult terrain. All the way until... Here... And here. That's all... Everything in, everything in this vicinity... Is now... Difficult terrain. Hmm. Alright, so... These guys' turns, yay! They're gonna run the fuck away! They're in difficult terrain as well. Uh... Because of my black hole, it creates difficult terrain. Did not know that, thank you. It's because it's suck- it, it's like a constant sucking force, so it makes yeah. it difficult to rest. Alright, so that guy can make it there. Make it there, and this guy's double difficult terrain, so he could just barely make it out. Alright. And, you know, that's just kind of fucking it. Midas is still stuck in here, like a. He's gonna whine. Uh, your turn! Okay, um. You guys do not. Uh, you guys are in difficult terrain. So, be warned. So, here's the thing. Yeah. Nick and uh, Jesse can both pull us up, so... Yeah. That's a good point, that's a good point. Uh, oh yeah, by the by the way, uh, those three get pulled five feet closer to the center. Got it. So into the water with them. Yeah. So, foom, foom. But this guy's stuck and... on, against a wall, so he's good. Uh, they all take 5d6 plus 3 damage. Lovely. Well, Jesus so, fuck. 15 damage. Yeah, they're definitely fucking hurt, I'll tell you that much. Alright. I'm actually gonna say that does it in for them. They're now, they've now dropped into the water. Uh, no, hold on. The thing, adding 3 more damage to it. Yeah, I know. They've been- So, it's- yeah, but additional three more damage to the damage yeah. I was there before. 5d4 plus 6 now. No, and then I'm no, gonna move to up. the water. They, fe they fell into the water. No, but... Oh, I thought you said that they were gonna die, okay. Never. No, they f they've fallen into the water, so, like, I'm gonna right, just yeah. take them out of the turn board because they're not gonna be able to get out. Mm-hmm. So, um. yeah. That leaves... Mm -hmm. That, um... Well, that leaves the rest of you guys, and mainly this guy left. Okay. Uh, so. I'm gonna just move up here. Minor issue. <laughs> Nick is no longer here. I'm well aware. If you look up in chat. I can make an athletic che check for him. He's That's all he's been doing, so I know it. I know his bonus. I mean. 
Yeah, do I need to make a check to climb for on him, that? So. No. Yeah, I, um, uh, I think Shuan's just hurrying this along because there's not really much yeah. else hungry. Nick can do. No, he, he's, he's just hungry. That's also true. Yeah. Sean's just incredibly hungry. Yes, I am really fucking hungry, and that chicken looks really fucking good. So, you know what? Inspiration. All right, that's an eleven. That's a that's a fifteen. Um, I just climbed up myself. Yeah. Okay, fuck you. Um, you are Noah. You are yeeted across to way over here by the power that is Nick's bulging muscles. <laughs> I don't know what else. I'm really hungry. Uh, and actually. I'm gonna say combat actually ends here, and you guys could just fucking bum rush to the actual exit. Okay, but what's gonna happen to Midas? Midas is gonna be stuck down here until the sp until the duration of your spell ends. And even then, which it's been how many turns? Like four turns, five, four, five. About four. So it will take him a bit. Plus, he's still six. Another six stuck. turns of him being stuck there. So that also. He's still largely made of gold, and it's really dense. So he's gonna have a hard time moving. And how do I have to deal with him again later? Well, hopefully this will be your last encounter. Uh, plus, with Midas, him. along with many undead, cannot leave the boundaries that is the sea. So... Meaning they can't. Most of them can't stay on for solid land for very long. Okay, but like, still. This will hopefully be your last encounter with them. Mm -hmm. Well, hopefully is not. Yes, this will be your last encounter. It just probably is. Yes, most likely. Yes, fate undetermined. Yes. I'm going to say. All rush for the exit, kicking down the door, which leads into the cellar of an of a abandoned home. As you all rush through the water, slowly, ru uh, quickly rises up to catch you. You leave the basement, as the basement is now flooded. As you are now confronted with a new figure. Oh. A sword of the evil eye. The very same one that pulled Nick away. As this is where we're going to end up, end off tonight's session. I hope all of you enjoy. we get a level? Uh, I'm going to go eat because I'm really hungry. And... we get a level though? No. What? We just did a boss fight. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> so, you all have a good one, and I'll be seeing you guys next time. Bye bye! We're coming after you, Shuin. We're gonna come after you, Sean. We won a level! Too bad.